it does kind of give you a better, a little more positive outlook that she's, she's fighting pretty hard. A North Tonawanda mother talking about her little baby girl, Diana, who is she's preparing to say goodbye to only weeks after her birth. But as she and her husband try and make their daughter's remaining time with us as peaceful as possible, they're also trying to get a hold of all the pictures of the night that she was born. You see, the family says those images were on a cell phone that was stolen last night, and all they want is to get it back. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Josh Bazan brings us the story you'll only see on 7 tonight. My favorite part is her hair so soft. Diana Seneca is a lot like many other babies, sometimes fussy, sometimes sleepy. She'll hear people talking, kind of like, I hear you over there. What are you saying? Or, you know, feed me, I'm hungry. Now. <laughs> But unlike many other babies, Diana was born with a neurological disorder called holoprosencephaly, or HPE. She has a cleft lip and suffers from seizures. She's hooked up to oxygen and eats through a feeding tube. Dana and Jessica just brought her home today from Oshai Women and Children's Hospital, where she'll live her remaining days at home in hospice. I mean, as, as hard as it really is, I just try to say, okay, today's almost over. Tomorrow morning is a new day, and that's just, you know, another new day added spent with her. Not knowing how much time they have left with Diana makes these moments so much more precious. She's awesome. Love looking at her. And Almost every moment at the hospital was captured with Jessica's cell phone. Last night, she says that phone was taken from the Ronald McDonald Lounge at Oshai, and with it, so many of those precious moments. Mike even started crying, just saying all, all the pictures are on there. I don't care, even like about the phone. The Senecas are asking whoever has the phone to return it to the hospital. Ronald McDonald House Charities is working with Oshai to try and find the phone, a gray Samsung Galaxy S8, and get it back to the family. She may not be here with us for, for much longer, and that's documentation of her life, of, of her being here, of, of smiling. Josh Bazan, 7 Eyewitness News.